Today is Thursday. Um, it is 10 o'clock a.m. I am working from home. I just got up and you know got myself together, brush my teeth, wash my face, put a little clothes on, you know. Um, because what am I doing today? I am going, I'm about to eat me some breakfast and then um well some strawberries and probably drink some tea and then um i have to drop off an order to the uh post office if you haven't already go shop the collection right now there's an end of season sale so everything on the website is 50 percent off also you can use the code free for free shipping the link will be in the description box below so go get y'all this because baby you're trying to get rid of the fall for the winter so yeah um what else was i saying but yeah i have to drop off an order and then um i need to go to the store to get some halloween decorations slash fall decorations slash whatever because i'm in the spirit so and i'm and i'm slacking i'm slacking it is october 7th i should have been had this up october 1st so, and I threw my decorations from last year away because I didn't want them. So, yeah, um, I need to go to the store and get some decorations, drop this package off, and then, yeah, I have to work out today. What else am I doing today? Um, mm, I don't know. Who knows? But, uh, this thing kind of heavy. But, um, yeah, I'm doing that today, and then... I need to wash one of my wigs and style it. I think I'm going to wash that curly wig and style it. And put it on. Not today, but I'm going to probably wash it and style it today. So I can put it on later. Probably in a couple of days. Because I need to take these out and wash it. Also, uh, what else I have to say? I forgot. But anyway. Um, and like I said, I'm trying to sell most of these clothes that I have now so that I can launch my fall collection slash winter collection, the next season collection. Um, which is really going to consist of Probably a jogging suit. No, not probably. That is the main piece, honestly. A jogging suit with my logo on it. Um, I have the dress already that I'm launching, and then probably a sweater, and probably one other piece um, that I'm gonna launch with those. He want to make my own sweater, but the my, the sewing machine that I got was a just a little cheap thirty dollar sewing machine, and it's really small, so you really can't even sew nothing with it. Like you can't sew like sweater material with it. So I already tried, it, so it didn't keep stopping. So I need to invest in a really good sewing machine. Cause I used to sew, my granny taught me how to sew when I was little. And then I was in a sewing class in high school and I did a sewing internship where we like sewed bags for like NASA. And, um, and I used to sew uh, like my baby doll clothes and stuff like that. I used to just, yeah. So, <laughs> um, I really need to invest in like a better 
like a good sewing machine. So yeah, I need to invest in a lot. And I'm trying to get into this, get back into this hair business because baby, because baby, they are making money out here. Like they are making bank. And some of the uh, some of the installs I be seeing, some of the you know, they don't be looking up the paw for the amount they be paying. Like this one girl I seen, she uh paid like five hundred dollars for some simple style, and it was like real simple like a real simple install so i'm hoping that the wig was included baby because if it wasn't girl people are really paying money out here for this stuff i'm trying to get a piece so i want a piece of the pie i want a piece of that i want a piece of that pie i really do and i'm kind of good at doing installs but i need to get good good like great at doing installs because baby i want a piece of that money i want a piece of that i want a piece of the pie i want a piece of that good pie mm -hmm. that good pie because yeah yeah and i wear and i wear wigs most of the time like if i'm not having braids every once in a while or if i'm not having my afro out every once in a while which i don't i have it out every blue moon i have braids every blue moon like because i don't i don't do my hair myself i did this myself but i retired my fingers so i try to avoid doing my hair myself so when someone's not available aka my sister my sister's not available then i either do it myself or i don't get it done at all so most of the time i have a wig on my head so and i don't go to nobody i do not pay nobody to put it on my head because youtube is free so <laughs> i do it myself so i feel like i need to capitalize on that yeah and then I'm always buying hair, so it's like I might as well just sell hair. Like, why don't I sell hair? Why, why don't I sell hair? Like, I sold lashes. I've done braids. I've done sewings. I sell clothes. I've done. I do nails. Like, why don't I sell hair? Why don't I sell hair? I should have stuck to hair. I should have stuck to here. But I hate doing braids so much. But I used to like doing sewing. So it's like, I don't know. I should have just stuck to it. <laughs> I should have just stuck to hair. I don't know why I didn't. But to say that, if you in Dallas, Hit up my sister. I will put her Instagram in the description box below. She do all types of braids, baby. She loves braiding hair. <laughs> uh, like me, she loves braiding hair. So hit her up if you need your hair to hit. She do box braids. She do locks. She do retwists. She do starter locks. She do, you know, all the box braids. She do knot lists. She do the faux locks. Like, she do all that. All that. All that. All that. All that. So hit her up. <laughs> hit her up. I will put her Instagram in the description box below. Period. Okay, so right now I am in Dollar Tree trying to figure out what kind of theme I want. Um uh, oh, they got these really nice cute brown spiders. This is cute. And I used to have like some spider, um, like web net, whatever. I threw that away <laughs> Um, let's see. I don't even know, like, what kind of 
scary. I'm trying to get a ball. Outside the door, it's like glitter. Um, I don't know. Okay, y'all. So I just got. Please excuse this seatbelt sign because I'm about to get right back out the car. But <laughs> I got my decorations from Dollar Tree out of the little that they did have. But I'm about to stop by Target and see if I can. I also got like a little, a little fall decoration for like the island um, in my uh, apartment. But uh, I'm about to stop by. You got to stop sign, nigga. I'm about to stop by um, Target and go to their Halloween section and see if I can find more. Um, more stuff like I, I not really more stuff but like um more like I, I want some lights like for the balcony I wanna uh, get some lights for them not for them I wanna get some lights for the balcony so I'm gonna stop by Target and see if I can uh, find something. This is the little faucet. The little faucet. Oh. Cute. Do I need to scoot it over? So I'm playing Sims right now. And let me show you my family. Okay, so this is my Sims. And that is... Well, actually, I died for real. I drowned in the pool. Don't know why. Don't know how. <laughs> but I died in the pool. Um, and then... Before I died, though, I had three kids. So they are, they at school right now. And then this is the new wife, Katrina. And this is the old, the widow, when I died. These are the rooms, hold on. I'm trying to show y'all. I'm trying to show y'all. These are their rooms upstairs. That's the bathroom. This is the athletic one room. This is the smart one room. And this is like the creative one room, period. And this is my bar area. Look how nice that is. I know. Anyways, this is my study. Oh. This is my study right here. I need to add some more stuff in. Like that lamp right there, don't even go. But this is our room. 
over here. This is the bathroom, this is the kitchen, coffee maker, microwave, then we got the living room up here, dining area, then this is the backyard. I'm trying to show you. I'm trying to use my hand. Ooh, I am not. Alright, this is right here. This is a pool. Um, Michaela. Okay, this is the pool area. This is where I drown. <laughs> and that is my plant over here that I'm planting or that I I have I need some water but I just planted some onions and then that's a apple tree and that is a plantain tree and this is my grill over here I can make everything on this grill like elote is that how you say elote and steaks and gumbo and I can make all types of stuff and then this is like a little monkey bars for my kids when they was younger now they older so yeah that's my sim period but yeah when i um the reason i got three kids i don't know the reason i got three kids but what had happened was i had got pregnant but i didn't know i was pregnant with triplets <laughs> so when I went into the hospital to have the baby, um, the thing, a notification pops up and it's like, um, enter your kid's name. So I enter a name and then I press, I kept pressing okay. And then I'll have to do it again. And I press okay and I have to do it again. And I was about to turn the game off that last time that I had to do because I thought the game was messing up like I thought like it wasn't working so I was about to turn the game off <laughs> but, but three babies popped up on the screen and they was all named the same girl I was flabbergasted I was like, no, y'all need to take it back. Take it back, take it back, take it back. Take them kids back, please. But yeah, so they was all named the same, so I had to change their names. But anywho. <laughs> and then I died in the pool. I don't know how. I guess I didn't know how to swim. <laughs> but yes, sis, I died in the pool which is so crazy like why how i didn't even get to get old yet and she about to die the widow is about to die so because they give us a notification saying like she's about to live her last days or whatever so yeah but i'm about to I'm playing this um right now. Okay, y'all. And we back. Period. I'm about to start cooking. I'm eating some of the chicken and rice period. That birthday tastes like pancake. A pancake. Yep. And guess what we drinking on? So we have some Cayman Jack. The Margarita Fleba. Three. What percentage is this? Oh, that's 5.8. I didn't even know it was that heavy. And then, let me show you how to bottle alcohol. Ooh. We have Casa Noval. Yeah, this is 51% alcohol. Go get you some. Okay, y'all. I'm about to um, make this chicken. I'm about to chop it up so I can stick it on the stove. Oh, what season is smell? What? Period. What 
Scotty season. Look at that bad boy. Look at that bad boy. So y'all can see what I'm doing if, in case y'all want a little cooking lesson, period. Whatever. Hey, good afternoon. So, I am about to go to, um, where am I going? I'm going to the hair store. I am going to the hair store because I need, um, some shampoo, some more shampoo and stuff. Because I am about to... Head. I'm about to put um this wig on my head, so I need some more. Uh, I don't have no more shampoo, so. But anyways, like I was saying, like I just been so down. Like I've been. I wouldn't say down. I just been so overwhelmed with like everything. 
But like I was saying, I just been so overwhelmed. I wouldn't say down, I would say overwhelmed with everything that's been going on. And it's just like, when I get overwhelmed with things that are happening in my life and around me, I just shut down. And I don't be having the energy to do nothing like I literally, I literally do not be having the energy to do nothing throughout my day. Cause it's like, I be having so much to do, but it's like, where do I start? And it's like, I, do, I knock nothing off a list, I like, Every time I do knock something off a list, I add some back on them. Like, it's just been so overwhelming. And I just be trying to take on too much, I think, at a time. And complete too much at a time to where, like, I just burn myself out. And I don't want to do nothing. So, um, I am trying to I was watching um YouTube I was watching YouTube and um I watched Glimmer and Tay and and she was talking about like uh she her car keeps getting you know uh broken into and so on her recent blog she was um staging her car and like uh, she put some type of crystal in there and some black salt. So, like, listening to her explain all that stuff, it just um, made me want to get more in tune with my spirituality and, you know, um, get more in tune with myself and start meditating and start just finding peace within me so that um, I can take on what I need to take on. Um, yeah, so I think I'm gonna just start, you know, um, reading up on crystals and reading up on energy and reading up on um, just like things like that, you know, so it can help me get balance in my life. <laughs> can balance me out you know so yeah because everything right now is nothing bad necessarily that's been happening it's just a lot that's been happening it's a lot going through my head of like where i want to be in life and where i see myself and where i'm trying to go and my businesses and what i'm trying to do with my businesses and just um Like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But, um, let me go in this store. Also, ladies, <laughs> please be safe out here because niggas is crazy. Like, they are crazy. Literally, like, like, literally. Like, it used to just be like, you go in the store, somebody might ask for your number, or somebody might whistle or some shit. You ain't really thinking nothing of it. But these days, niggas don't give a fuck no more. Like, niggas literally, when the fuck can I go? Like, Mm. Niggas would literally But like I was saying 
own. Niggas will literally kidnap your ass. Like, they will literally just, oh, like, it, it, it makes me so mad because you can't even go to the, in the store without niggas just watching you. Men watching you, watching your every move. You don't know if they about to kidnap you. You don't know if they about to grope on you in the store. You don't know if they about to, like, be one of them ones that get mad if you don't give them your number. Like, you don't know what they about to do. You literally don't know. I never go to the gas station at night. I don't go in the store at night. Don't park in no parking lots where I have to get out. I know I'm parking no type of uh, parking lots where I have to get out um, at night. You know, like, no type of grocery store parking lots or nothing like that. Seriously. None of that. Oh, I love the hair store so much. I want to be a hair store. <laughs> now I'm about to go up in here. Let's go. Come on, Adam. Oh, she said, come over. I'm loose. I'm tripping. Like, I didn't take, like, three years of steam. Oh. 